The county government of Mandera has launched the second round of relief food distribution in the entire county to cushion residents from effects of drought. The relief intervention is expected to cover 60,000 households across 30 wards, including vulnerable households and IDPs. Mandera Governor Mohammed Aden Khalif urged the national government and other donors to intervene and to avert loss of lives. The prolonged failure of rains for five consecutive seasons has resulted in inflated prices of foodstuff, which has seen many Kenyans unable to afford the basics. In Mandera, the worst hit areas are Mandera West, Mandera South and Banisa constituencies. Following this, Mandera County government has begun its second phase of food distribution in the entire county. The relief intervention is expected to cover 60,000 households across 30 wards and 517 centers, including vulnerable households and IDPs. <laughs> Mandera County Governor Mohamed Adan Khalif, while launching the food distribution, said they want to ensure those who need it most get the food. Our population that's actually facing the acute food insecurity is almost uh, 550,000 households. And it, it will continue becoming even worse as we approach uh, 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 this month. And inshallah, we pray that we're going to get the March, April, May. Uh, rain, otherwise the station will go to be very bad. The governor appealed to national government and development partners to chip in before the situation worsens. We are really exhausted. Being as the first line of response, the county government who have been struggling with the mega, mega resources that we have been having, but the challenges is now becoming uh, uh, heavy on us. We really appeal to our development partners to scale up their effort, their support. We call upon the people of Mandera, those who are able to support uh, their neighbors, their family members and their friends. According to the February 2023 Short Rains Assessment Report by National Drought Management Authority, the population facing acute food insecurity and requiring humanitarian assistance has increased to approximately 550,000 in Mandera. We've just done the assessment some few weeks ago and the report has been out, the short range, and it is very evident that uh, the drought situation is really biting across the county.